And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Barcelona against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. This is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And operating in attack today, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Angel Di Maria starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And now the Champions League final commences. He's given the ball away unnecessarily. Messi. Mbappe. An effective challenge. Is this the moment? Mbappe! And a goal! It's for Paris Saint-Germain. The first goal of this Champions League final. Incredible scenes. Well, here it is again. And it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. I get the ball moving once more how will they react Di Maria and it's Messi going forward what's he going to do next Messi, what a save! Corner kick played in, and a bit short with the clearance. Well, another corner following on from the last one. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. A foul it most certainly was, free kick given. Can they extend their lead? 
And the keeper denies them from the spot. Fired in by Neymar. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Messi. Chance for Di Maria. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Messi. He has time to play it over. Something to worry about here. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. Good work from Barca to make sure possession changed hands. Sergio Busquets. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Tempele. Teammates in the middle. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. on that Wijnaldum Verratti racing forward trying to catch them out all in all a broken counter attack now what can they do from here incisive pass from Mbappe well the keeper reacted magnificently the short corner routine Messi and no way through illegal play and hence a free kick A chance to extend the lead and slot it home well his heart might have been fluttering but he didn't show it a goal from the spot well as you can see the keeper dives one way and the ball goes down the middle it's a very good penalty Second goal for them here. De Jong. Now Busquets. Oh, good use of the ball. Ferran Torres. 
Weighted ball from Aubameyang. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Well, PSG have controlled most of the possession, as you can see. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball, which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Could reduce the deficit. And a throw-in it's going to be. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge. And it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. And who knows, that might be the end of the story for them in this one. Well, I'm sure you're right. He's just lost his discipline there. It's an uphill battle now. Di Maria well it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it Messi my goodness that save fully stretched he was one for his own highlights reel They favoured a short one here. Can he finish? And Neymar! And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. De Jong. Sergio Busquets. Now with De Jong. Obama Yang. It's a perfect challenge. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Well, that was a terrific attack, but they'll be disappointed about the way it ended. Well, it's good play. They force the error, break forward quickly, and create the opening. However, the finish didn't match the rest of it. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. They might see the wide route as a fruitful one, PSG. No way through. Pedri. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Now Jordi Alba. Pedri. Sergio Busquets. Aubameyang. Now with De Jong. And Aubameyang in control of the ball in that advanced position. Can he get one back? Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Di Maria. Messi. And Barcelona have possession again. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Now, what 
on earth happened there? Barassi. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Dembele. Ronald Araujo. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position, but really sticking to their task defensively. Messi. On well, the pass from Messi, but not quite accurate enough. Counter attacking, very much an option. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Hakimi. Ferrati. Now Messi. Superb stop. Keen to take it short here. Has a go. Superb block. So a throw in here. Pedri. Sergio Busquets. Now Busquets. Dembele. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Useful ball to the near post. Well, he deserves praise for inventiveness, but not troubling the keeper. Verratti. Di Maria now. Promising looking ball. It's still there for him. Well, tremendous block. And breaking at pace with Menace. All hands on deck. No possibilities inside the box. Clattered away. Paris Saint-Germain with the ball again. Well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. Di Maria. Messi. Di Maria. Verratti now. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. PK. Sergio Busquets. And Barcelona being afforded too much space. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Depay. And they deal with the threat this time. De Jong. He's in control of the situation. Well, not so fast. The referee says penalty and maybe a late glimmer of hope for them. Well, he's also showing him the yellow card. Yeah, he had to make the challenge, but it was always going to be risky, and so it proved. 
Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. They know they've got to convert this. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it. Throw-ins given. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Crossing opportunity. Pulls it back. And possibilities here. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Bodies forward and the break looks on. Will they profit from this situation? De Jong. Depay. Let's fly here. And they produce the arrears. You never know. They still believe in themselves. Well, just look at this strike again. He hits it so well. That's a great bit of skill. No wonder he's pleased with himself. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night.